YouTube, what's going on family? Welcome back to the channel. I go by the name of Boston David for those of you that are new around here. Look, every time I leave the scene, the scene reminds me why I leave the scene. It's a whole lot of weird shit, it's a whole lot of fake shit and I just don't condone it. So we got a streamer, YouTuber, um, came across my radar randomly. He goes by the name of Light Nightland. Okay, so drop the 50 kill banger. We're gonna be going over it. This dude's allegedly cheating. Nah, fuck that. All these pushes are cheating. And we're going to be here to call him out. I hope you guys can appreciate me being back. I look forward to being back. I'm excited to be here. So let's go. Video is about to be an absolute certified banger. You guys already know that. Okay. Yeah, so with the way this guy titles his videos, he says 50 kills, but it's actually two gameplays put into one video. So we're going to do two parts of this video. So it's not too uh, dragged out for you guys. So the first one is with the Bison. And it's going to be a 20 kill game here on Rebirth. We're going to go over it. And I'm going to show you guys exactly what what it is that was so obvious to me when i came across this randomly and there's a lot of other streamers i plan on going over facebook especially that are the same exact way and a lot of people are playing rebirth right now it's very very popular so <clears throat> bear with me as we go through this let's not waste much more of your time and get right into the video so we're going to start the clip here so you guys can get the full details of the clip in question um and one thing with a lot of these players is they once they get their information from the radar or their esp or their walls or whatever it is that they are using they go on the hunt without any details that a regular person who's not cheating would have and i'm going to showcase this right away because again once i seen this it was very obvious okay so let's take a look at it Oops. all right now notice he's focused up here right there's probably an enemy right here. Now, I'm going to just go ahead and tell you that there is an enemy right here. There's actually two of them, but there's no way for him to know that he was all the way over here looting, right, in the corner. So what makes you come over here versus going to the right, going underneath the prison or whatever, you know? There's probably a team up top. I would think I've played this game enough. And even if I haven't played this game enough, it doesn't change the fact that these motherfuckers are cheating. Are you going to turn me up this morning? All right, now you can see there's a player at the end of the hallway right here, right? But also, there's a player right here. So the player probably was looting over here then ran over here to loot, but the dude had tracked him through the walls, new, right? What are you doing? You too. Boom, like clockwork. Now let's go back and watch. Watch the tracking, right? only focus right here there's a reason for that there's nothing on the mini map right here right hey, you gonna turn me up this morning what are you doing you too that ain't sweet got up right, I'll, that. I'll let you get your little time now in your ass buddy body don't tell me now the important thing to notice about this clip is he already knew that there was somebody to the left now i understand when you kill somebody the little red dots pop up but let's just go back all right so he knows his teammate got up right knows the teammate got up right now they're over here now your eyes buddy Knows he's not down there, so he's going to push over here. But before he pushes out, he knows something. Okay. Now, you would think that they're over here, right? And you're just going to come up behind them or something, right? There's, If the enemies are right here on this map, you're going to want to push this way. You're not going to go right here, but something stops them. Now, he's going to play it off because they all play it off, but he knew. Got a body. He, Don't tell me. He's going to play it off like he's joking, man, but he knew. You just don't. Not not in that situation. Oh, your eyes, buddy. And I mean, sure, if you're a good player, you're going to look over there, but nah, bro. Got a body. Don't tell me. <laughs> All right, we might be in a lobby. I got to lock in. So that to me is clear signs of walls. Like even, 
even here. Alright, we might be in a lobby. Okay. <laughs> Buddy. And just look at his facial expression. He's acting like, oh, I'm all surprised. Like, let me let me act like I'm concentrating. Like, nah, man. <laughs> he knew bro was right here the whole time. Let's take it back a little. Now he's going to play it off and be like, oh, is that a body? And that's what they do. And you'll notice a lot with this guy's gameplay. He doesn't push anything until he plays it off first. But we'll, we'll go over it and you'll see. So let's. All right. So in this next clip, he runs exactly where he needs to run to place him right where they need to be placed in order to find an enemy. Now, once he finds this enemy, he plays it off like I told you he was going to do. And then he engages. Let's go ahead and roll the clip out so we can take a look. But there's nothing on the mini map, right? showing where this player would be now he did kill an enemy and somebody did ping right here we'll actually go back so you can see that so there's no okay enemy so right here you got an enemy right here it's ping right there Now he knows this enemy's here. He knows it, right? But if he goes and pushes him right off to this corner, then it's gonna be blatant obvious signs of walls, right? This enemy from the time that he showed up on the radar could have went anywhere, but he knows. He's very, and as you can see in his facial expressions, he's very, very focused on what is going on right here. Okay. So now he goes back. Now this is the most important part because they know that they have YouTube careers and things on the line, so they're not going to be so obvious as to where they're going to get caught. So these signs and symbols are very important to not only make note of, but to pay attention to. So let's just go back a little bit. Now he's very focused right here. Then he goes back. Of course, there's enemy. So he's not gonna he's not gonna engage the enemy until enemy shows himself so Notice here in this he clip he's at control center a few enemies have they flown all... in but he knows from his radar hacks that there's a bunch of enemies here so before he goes and runs to exact locations and gives himself away he's going to go pop a uav and then he's going to run to exact locations let's take a look at the clip so you guys can see exactly what i'm talking nice about start. there's a uav pop now now you see all the enemies. Now he has free reign, so. Now, normally you have no idea that dude's peeking the corner, but because he had the radar, he could see and knew exactly. These are just little signs that might skip over you while watching the video that you need to be paying attention to. Okay, nothing there shows him that this kid's peeking around the corner, but he knows. All right. So let's go back a little bit. He knows that because walls, and now, let me itch my eye. He's pointing right where an enemy is knows he's on the second floor right they shield up then back to work i can't snipe somebody change my title please now it's the pre-aiming of the exact location that i want you guys to really my pay title, attention please? to see now this kid could be anywhere right he's got a uav up sure but he knows exactly where this kid's going to be coming because he knows he's running currently because of the walls on his screen that he's looking at now aimbot snaps are very hard to catch 
when it comes to snipers. So I'm going to slow this clip down for you guys, and I want you guys just to take a real close look at this. So there he hit the rocks, right? And he's a, he's accustomed to playing with the sheets, so he knows the adjustment he has to make to be able to do this. This is a very quick shot. He doesn't even aim in, really. That that right there is an unnatural aim snap. Now let's go back a little bit. All right, we'll slow it down even a little bit more. Okay. We'll go back a little. Now, as soon as he gets in the ratio box, it snaps right in. He hits a shot. Now, that's another thing that you're going to want when you're looking for a sniper aimbot or people that use snipers, which a lot of these people do, especially in Rebirth. You're going to want to slow the clip down and take a look at it like that, as we did. Now, here in this clip, he knows that there's enemies right over here in the direction of the water tower, but he's going to cross over directly to my right to play it off. Now, he's not going to engage these enemies until he gets shot at, which is playing it off, right? But he's going to know the exact location of where these enemies are, especially the dude that shot at him and ran behind the wall. He's going to know, and he's going to point and pre-aim exactly over there. You guys will see us roll the clip out. This will be the last clip of the video. Let me know what you guys think about all this in the comments. It's good to be back. Hope you guys look forward to hearing from me, and I will see you in the next one. Peace. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Now, he gives himself away a little bit right here. Okay, yeah. See, there's nobody over there yet, but he knows that there's players over here somewhere. All right? That's why he, he didn't look over there for no reason. Waits till he gets shot. Now, this is the preamp. He knows this kid's over here, he, and, and there's no way to know. They got shot at with the silenced gun, right? Yeah, me. So before he snipes that kid, he's in the he's in the perfect spot, right? The pre-aim. I don't know who's shooting at me. Damn. But he can't do nothing until he sees the dude. See, this is tall tale signs. This to me gives a lot away. Now, he wasn't going to engage in none of these players until he got shot at or had a cue that wasn't going to give himself away for the walls. But this, to me, is tall tale proof and signs of hacks in Warzone done by a lot, if not majority, of the streamers in the game today. Let me know what you guys want to cover next. <clears throat> I have a big video of a very obvious out there guy who gets accused a lot. He's a Facebook streamer. We're going to be going over that really soon. I'm going to do a couple reaction videos I've been asked to do. Um, sorry if I'm late. Sorry for the delay. It's good to be back, man. Love you guys as always. Peace.